it's Dana here and today is Sunday April 14th <sighs> we had a long day we just got back from three stores uh, we went to the Dollar Tree and then we went to Walmart and then I forgot something at Walmart so we went to the Dollar General to go pick up what I forgot and then we grabbed extra I went to the Dollar Tree for some stuff specifically and that didn't happen because our Dollar Tree just sucks. <laughs> uh, it didn't have the items I was looking for. I was looking for the beach um, stuff. I was looking for the uh, like the beach signs and um, uh, pictures and they only had uh, the candle holders. That's about it. Uh, which I got two seahorses um, but yeah so let's start off with um, weight loss update uh, so I uh, fasted from 8 p.m. yesterday I kind of wasn't really feeling very well on Saturday uh, I didn't I only got like three hours of sleep so I was just running off of fumes so I decided to kind of go to bed really early. I woke up early this morning. Um, I fasted for about 12 hours and I got on the scale and I lost 1.1 pounds. So now I am at 306.4 pounds and that makes me happy. Uh, now, just to get back down to 304 where I originally was in February and then I'll be even more happy and then I can work from there to finally hit my first goal which will be 299 pounds and then I'll work from there after I hit my first goal so 1.1 pounds down makes me happy all right so I we went to I guess I'll show the stuff I got from Walmart so I decided to get some more um, plates and bowls and uh, and mugs so I got a, a set uh, the current ones we have I'm kind of tired of them they're like a weird this weird green color and I'm kind of changing my kitchen more to like a red you know red and black kind of tones so it's just time to just update some stuff so I got this um, it's Corel uh, classic um, 16 piece dinner wear set uh, it's white with red and grayish colored swirls um, the mug in it is red because it, it comes with four plates four bread and butter plates which is probably the plates I'm going to be using to have my serving sizes on uh, four soup cereal bowls and four stoneware mugs which I'll probably be getting rid of some of my mugs as well I guess we can uh, I have a box that I can put our current stuff in and I guess we can bring it to uh, Goodwill and donate it to them so this is it it looks like that and the uh, the mugs are red in it and they're a bit light they're a bit lightweight which is perfect because that's what I want lightweight and they are microwave and dishwasher safe I don't have a dishwasher though uh, unless you call unless you count me as a dishwasher <laughs> uh, then we do have a dishwasher so you shush. <laughs> that's my husband in the background. I don't know if you heard him or not. <laughs> so uh, that's what I got. Uh, let's see. Where... All right. So then I also decided to get another one. This is the this is the color that my hair is supposed to be. <laughs> but as you can tell, that didn't happen. Uh, so I got another one. I had, uh, like I said, I was going to get another one. Uh, it's the smoky blue. Um, by L'Oreal Paris and uh, goofy old me missed that it says exclusive for blondes so I also got I also got the L'Oreal Paris uh, extreme platinum absolute platinum but it's extreme platinum 
Um, this is actually a bleach, but you can you can use it as a to you know have your hair blonde, and it has my color on it. So that's why I'm gonna use this first. Then I gotta wait 14 days after using this, and then I can use this. So I got that, those two. We saw this. Uh, I like mocha coffee. It's just my, I prefer that. Uh, and this is just the Walmart uh, version of it. Um, great value. Uh, it's medium roast, rich and smooth mocha ground coffee. So I got that. Um, uh, so I got that. Then I saw. Uh, well, that's for my husband. I don't drink. I don't drink that one bit. <laughs> he got that for himself. Uh, but um, so my husband got himself the Earl Grey black tea. Uh, he hadn't had that in a while, and he really likes Earl Grey tea, so he got that to enjoy. He was rubbing his hands already. I saw these. I don't know how good they are. They're by SlimFast, but it's Keto Fat Bombs. Um, optimal, optimal, optimal <laughs> low-carb ketogenic nutrition, uh, zero sugar, co coconut oil MCTs, peanut butter cups. So it's these. And there are six grams of carbs, three grams of fiber, no sugar, no added sugar. Well, unless you call it uh, erith erythritol. And one protein, nine fat, 90 calories for a cup. A cup? <laughs> I guess they mean one peanut butter cup, maybe? Because there's 14 servings a cup. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I saw that and was like, curious you know I keep seeing it I might as well you know check it out now the main reason why I went to Walmart was because I heard of the ketogenic coffee um, the rapid fire mind body and soul uh, this one could be good hot or cold is instant coffee and I'm most likely gonna do it cold because I really do like iced coffee and it's this oh, it's backwards um, but yeah, it's the ketogenic uh, co instant coffee. I've never tried it before. It has three grams of carbs, no fiber, less than one gram of sugar, less than one gram of protein, nine grams of uh, fat, and it's 100 calories. And the serving size is two tablespoons. So there's 15 servings in, in this. So then I got this. Um, this is the ketogenic coffee pods. Um, original blend, grass-fed butter, medium chain, triglycerides, Himali uh, Him 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 Himalayan salt, uh, this is medium roast, uh, got the uh, coffee pods uh, for our, uh, we have a Hamilton Beach uh, Keurig, uh, uh, so I'll be trying this, and then I had made a sandwich or something, and I don't remember what it was. And I wanted barbecue sauce, but the barbecue sauce I like is Sweet Baby Ray's, and it's totally not, it's totally bad. So I couldn't, oh, it was an egg sandwich. Uh, I had made my own bread. It's supposed to be keto-friendly bread, but I guess I must have messed up on it or something because it came out too wet. Well, it came out moist didn't come out great but I, I threw it in the new toaster oven which I absolutely love it and I couldn't have the barbecue sauce because it wasn't uh well carb friendly <laughs> so my husband mentioned that he remembered seeing that there was a sugar-free barbecue sauce and so we we went and we saw it and it's by G Hughes and it had hickory uh, sugar-free barbecue sauce it's only two grams of uh, carbs uh, 10 calories which is wonderful so I'm going to enjoy this and it's gluten-free which I'm not gluten intolerant or anything uh, then there's this sugar-free one it's just regular or original two grams of carbs as well and I'm gonna enjoy this too <laughs> then 
I'm not much of a ketchup person, but I ended up seeing it and it's by G. Hughes again. Sugar-free ketchup. And this one is one gram of carbs. And this is gonna be pretty cool. So yeah, I've never tried it before. Uh, so I used to have one of these uh, when I wash my hair. Sometimes I like to pull my hair up and like I said, I don't really like my, I don't like wet hair on my back. I don't know why, I just don't. So I got another one of these uh, Turby Twists to wrap my hair up in uh, when my hair is drying. And I had one, but I don't know what happened to it. Uh, got it in white. So, cause I don't blow dry my hair. I, let, I like to let my hair just, you know, dry on its own. I have always done it that way. I try blow drying it. I don't like the way it does my hair. It makes my hair go from what it looks like here to poof, <laughs> to I don't know what the heck just happened. <laughs> uh, let's see. Then I got uh, some organic uh, multivitamin for women. Uh, it's plant-based. It's a vegetarian uh, tablets. So, cause uh, I can use some more vitamins in my life. Uh, let's see. I guess my husband must have grabbed this. Okay. The triple chocolate? Yeah, I thought that was it. Alright, so because I didn't grab it. <laughs> so my husband picked out a uh, great value brand. Um, triple chocolate medium roast. I uh, uh, don't know why I cannot pronounce that word for some reason. Because um, right. it looks like Arabic, but it's. Yeah, but it has an A. It's like Arabica. <laughs> I just can't seem to pronounce it. I'm sorry. Uh, well, this. <laughs> it's just it's just this. So. It's not Columbia, so. Yeah, but for some reason, I, I can't English today. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. <laughs> we are going to go to Dollar General. Um, now, I went to Dollar Tree like I said, to look for the beach um, stuff. And I wanted to get a bath mat for our uh, for our tub, because I slip uh, and I'm afraid I'm gonna fall because I slip, because I'll, you know, I'll use body wash and I wash my hair and sometimes, you know, it gets on the bottom of the tub and I lose my balance. So I'm afraid I'm gonna slip, so I needed another, uh, bath mat because I like to change mine out when you know over time well I forgot so then we went to Walmart and I had it in my mind which I forgot two more things <laughs> that we were supposed to get from Walmart and when we left I ended up uh, remembering oh I need the bath mat you know I'm afraid I'm gonna slip so we ended up going to Dollar General and I ended up picking up this uh, blue one um, it was like $3. Uh, and then I picked up, I got a 16 by 25 uh, air conditioner filter for our um, AC unit because I, I needed another one. And I really like to get these, these uh, scented uh, um, air conditioner filters to put in the, to place on the AC filter. And I usually get the lavender scent and they didn't have any so i decided to do to be different this time and i went with the tropical which it has a very citrusy uh smell to it and it i think it's going to be a nice smell <laughs> um then while my husband went and found the bath mats i ended up taking a turn oh i ended up taking a turn down the cat cat uh the pet aisle <laughs> and um I ended up uh, picking up some uh, Temptations Jumbo Stuff Salmon Flavored Treats for the cats. <laughs> uh, I spoil them a lot. And then, yes I do, I love my babies. So, well one of my babies is being naughty right now. So then I walked by and ended up seeing this uh, True Matte Lipstick, uh, Broadway Colors. Um, it's like a, it's called this one is called take me 
it's like a, a pinkish color. It's like a little pink color. Yeah, there you go. Um, so I'm going to try that out or whatever. Uh, so that is it of the Dollar General one. Um, and now the Dollar Tree. I can't go into Dollar Tree and get just one thing. I go into the Dollar Tree and I get many things and then I see things I didn't choose so I see my husband grab some stuff too <laughs> so oh I ripped it so um I got this magnetic uh, list uh pad it has like little uh a little cupcake and a rolling pin and I like to put these on the fridge and you know write notes or well, so that's that then I got this um, Mother's Day card from my mom. It looks like this. It's very pretty. Um, it says, for my wonderful mom. Uh, mom is love and love is everything. And then the inside says, from you I learned what love does. It gives almost anything, shows up for you anytime, and goes with you for a lifetime. Happy Mother's Day. My husband didn't pick up his mom one at all. He's a bad son. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsies. Then I picked up this three color eyeshadow. Um, it's like it has like a blue, a mauve color, and a uh, purple color. Um, so it, it looks like that. Um, then I got this cute little uh, plant that I saw. I decided if I was, you know, I wanted to take pictures of uh, my food if I make anything. So I thought about, you know, putting placement or something and it's nice and springy. Then I got these um, vanilla uh, tea lights for the candles I got. And then I got the vanilla scented uh, um, candles too. And I got this silver metallic, uh, I don't know why it doesn't, there we go, um, fingernail polish. Uh, can't wait to try that one out. And then, oh, I got a story. Okay, so I also picked up these vitamin Ds. I already got some iron pills. So I also got vitamin D because that is something I don't really go outside very much. And I picked up these. And... I grabbed, this was the only bottle that was left. They had a ton of vitamin E, they had a ton of vitamin C and other vitamins, but only two bottles bottles of vitamin D and this one was hidden all the way in the back. Well, the one that I grabbed was, I thought it felt very light. So I shook it and I didn't hear anything because here you can hear it. So I opened it up and it was empty the film was already peeled back so somebody went in there and stole 30 soft gels of vitamin d this is the dollar tree it's it's a dollar i just thought that was you know that's a bit ridiculous how are you gonna steal you know so they only had one left um then i i got this uh spatula uh because i needed one uh, I guess my husband needed uh, that for work. Nail clippers. Um, then he saw these uh, glue sticks. Uh, they're glitter, but they're for a mini glue gun. I don't have a mini one, but I will plan on getting one. So he got he picked up these. So because he knows I want to get back into arts and crafts again. I am very sorry that this video is going to be a bit longer. And um, here is another nail polish I picked up. It's like a mauve color, mauve, <laughs> mauve color, or so. Uh, I picked up that one to go with. Oh, to go with the other one. Um, then I picked up these. I needed some more of these. They got the little, little erasers on them. And he picked up some more 
uh, spoons, uh, large teaspoons and regular spoons. It's a two-piece set. Uh, we could have had gotten some forks too, but we didn't. Um, I did not pick this up, which is why I said my husband must have some googly eyes. So it looked like he picked up some googly eyes. So I'm assuming he has an idea to do with them. And then I picked up French lavender and citrus uh, facial wipes. Uh, oh, this one is breakable. Uh, Okay, let's see. I got in here another uh, little flowers and a little cute little vase. Now, this was the only beach set that I uh, that I found at our Dollar Tree. So they didn't have anything else. They had tons of Easter stuff and tons of the same stuff. Nothing really new. But I picked up two of these. Uh, they did have the seashell one, which is a very light blue, but I wanted two matching ones and I like seahorses. Could be because I like horses too, so seahorses, horses. <laughs> By Dana Logic. <laughs> so I saw this, but they only had this one left and I know there should have been probably other scents, but um, I got this gingerbread coffee candle and it looks like a little coffee cup which is pretty cool and it smells really good it smells like well gingerbread <laughs> so I got that and then I saw this which is fig and sandalwood and it's in a very cute little jar and um, this one smells really good too it smells like figs and sandalwood <laughs> And then I got this one, which is a uh, lemon and lavender. Oh, which smells like lemon mixed in with lavender, which smells really good as well. And um, I needed some Scotch uh, clear tape, so it comes with a two pack. And last. Uh, we got um, four tote bags. Uh, we have a pink one, a yellow, a green, and a blue, and they have little pineapples on them. Um, I like to use these for my freezer. So I like to put like meats in one and vegetables, whatever in one. And I, because I have a um, deep freezer and chest freezer. Or chest freezer, that's it. And um, I'm kind of, I'm not really short. I'm five foot five, but I kind of feel short. So when I have to reach all the way at the bottom, I can't. So I'm leaning over the edge and I'm kind of in the freezer <laughs> trying to get to the bottom. So we had gotten these because I have some other ones and I needed more. So I can put, you know, my groceries and stuff in them. So that way I can just grab the bag and pull out and, you know, grab what I need from them. Oh, my cat's in a box. <laughs> uh, put that there. Oops, I, I knew I had some more candles. All right, so I do have some more candles. I have this, which is um, citrus and sandalwood. And it comes in this very, very cute uh, blue jar. I got two of those. Um, so here's the other one. I got two of them. Then I got this. Uh, I like to put this in my bathroom. I got lavender and peach blossom uh, glade. I like to put that in the bathroom. I like to get a lot of my candles and scents from Dollar Tree. And then I got another nail polish, but this is the, um, it's uh, LA Colors Mega Grow. It's the clear um, drape treatment, uh, the clear that you could put over your nails. And then I got this tape dispenser, which sadly they didn't have the tape to go with it. They were out. Um, then I got this uh, to put in the sink so the food or whatever can go in there. Hi, Jamie Pants. 
No one, they can't see you. Jamie, they, oh, don't you play with that. <laughs> he's trying to grab, he's trying to grab this. <laughs> Come on, let's say hi, Jamie Pants. Look, tell everyone you say, say hi. Look, look, look. Oh, say hi, look, Jamie Pants. He has a twin, Foley. Jamie Pants is the fat one, huh? He's the fat one. <laughs> so then I got um, these little uh, containers. I didn't really care for the lid because that's not what I had gotten them. Uh, I got them for to make my own bread, to make my own low carb bread. And they needed, like, I bought a square one, but it was too big. Um, it was too big, so it made what I had made very thin. So I found a smaller one this time, and hopefully this one will work. And then I got a rectangular shaped one as well to go with it. But since it comes with the lids, I might as well have gotten the lids too. All right, so I also saw this. Um, it matches the mug, uh, the mug, <laughs> the rug. Uh, it is the Farm Fresh uh, towel, and it has a roaster on it, so it matches that rug, and then it has some of the colors and then I have lots of uh, almond flour coconut flour and a lot of times I don't like to keep them in their bags I prefer them to I prefer to put them in containers that way they can you know so the bag doesn't get ripped or the bag doesn't pop open so my husband grabbed a bunch of these uh, sure fresh professional uh, containers with their lids so I can put my, you know, almond flour and coconut flour in each one of these. And also, since they're slender, they won't take up as much space on my shelf over there. So, that looks like that's about it. So yeah, that was my, uh, my haul for, uh, for what we, uh, for going to Walmart, Dollar General, and the Dollar Tree. Also, I have this um, strap uh, for my Fitbit. Um, it goes on your ankle. And I had uh, stuck my Fitbit, uh, the little square um, meter thing, I stuck it in inside the strap and put it on my ankle so that way when I'm walking and I'm holding the cart, it still tracks my steps because if you're holding the cart, it doesn't because your arms aren't moving. So since it's on my ankle and my legs are moving, it actually tracks. So I got uh, 3,555 steps in today. I'm also a slow walker too, so I probably could have gotten more. And it, we were out and about for about uh, two hours. <sighs> so yeah, oh, and the before I forget, the nail polish that I had bought uh, the other day from Nail Polish from Fred's. Uh, I had gotten that pearly pink nail polish with the little glitter and then the pinkish colored one. So I did use them. Um, that's what they look like. That's the pearly pink. Very pretty, very pretty. And on this one, I didn't think about it, but I ended up using the pink one that I had gotten on this hand, I only did on one finger, and then I put the, um, let's see if I can get it to, there we go, and I end up putting the pearl, uh, the pearly pink oh, on top of it, and it looks so pretty. So, the nail polish looks so nice. <laughs> I really like them. And after I'm done with these, and they start uh, peeling apart, I am pro I am most likely going to use this one next. Uh, I have a, a, a container that has nail polish in it, but I don't remember where I put it. I've been cleaning up and when I move things, I don't remember where I put things. Uh, it's like I hide it from myself, <laughs> which is crazy. But yep, that is um, just like right now, I lost, there it is. <laughs> um, Thank you for watching. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.